Hey you guys, I hope you are doing well and are ready for some yoga. I know I am. I've had quite the day of sewing. Now I know that doesn't sound like it's intense, but when you're sitting there and you're like super focused, trying not to let that needle hit you, it's a bit intense. And then you're like, Ugh. anyways, let's do some yoga. So go to your mat, get everything all set up, have your water close by. You know the drill. Um, and if you're here with me live, please, I would love for you to give me a thumbs up, give me a heart, give me a something to let me know that you're actually here joining me in this virtual space. Can you guys believe we've been doing this since March? We're at the end of July. That's crazy. So, so crazy. Um, anyways, take a drink of your water because I'm sure it's close by. needed. Again, if you are joining me, give me a thumbs up. Give me a little heart. Tell me you're here because Facebook doesn't tell me that you are here anymore. And if you guys notice that my voice sounds a little harsh, it's because I was laughing and screaming on a river yesterday and it was a fantastic time and so, so worth losing my voice over. Anyways, I hope you guys are truly doing well. Let's do some yoga. So come on down to your mat. Get yourself nice and comfortable, legs crossed, sitting up nice and tall. Go ahead and close your eyes. Take a big inhale in through the nose. Exhale, press it out. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Notice if you're sitting up tall or if you're rounding here. Tuck your chin towards that back wall just slightly. And with that next breath, bring your right hand to your belly, your left hand to your heart. And take a big inhale. Exhale, pull your abs in, really press that air out. Inhale, really try to lift through the entire front side of your body, not just your chest, in. Exhale, press it out. One more, just like that. Big breath in. And big exhale. Great job. You can bring your hands back down to your legs. And we'll just stay here breathing just like we were practicing moments ago for about five breaths. Relax your shoulders down your spine. Notice where you're holding in that tension. And just feel yourself getting heavier into your mat. One more breath here. In. And out. Great. You can keep your eyes closed and listen to me or open them. It's your choice. Inhale, just sweep your arms all the way up, look up, big stretch. And exhale, float your arms down, tuck your chin right into your chest. Inhale, lift those arms up. And exhale, float them down. Inhale. And exhale. Great job. Inhale, bring those arms out in front, palms facing one another. Make sure we're sitting up nice and tall. Legs are getting heavy into your mat. Take a big breath in. And as we exhale, I want you to glide that right arm across your body. Open it up to the wall behind you. Look over that right shoulder. Focus on your breath here. Inhaling in. Big breath. And out. Two more breaths here. In. Out. One more. In. And with that exhale, bring that right hand forward and then send that left arm back. Focusing on your breath, focusing on sitting up nice and tall here, looking over that left shoulder. You can part your lips just slightly, releasing any tension you might have in your neck, in through your shoulders here. One more breath, in 
Exhale, bring that arm forward and do a one count. Inhale, exhale, send it back. Inhale, forward, exhale, back. In, out. Keep it going. Connect to your breath. Find a nice rhythm, flow to that movement. Get your head involved. We'll do one more each side. Last turn. Great job. Bring your hands back in front. I want you to drop your elbows right at your sides. Palm open to the ceiling here. Take a big inhale. And on the exhale, I want you to pull your thumbs towards that back wall, keeping your elbows tucked in right at your side, really feeling your shoulder blades loop around your back. Bring your hands forward. And exhale, send them back. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. Keep it going. One more. Great. Bring your fingertips right on your shoulders and send your elbows out in front of you. As we inhale, we're going to send our shoulders, our elbows going up towards the ceiling, parting them, opening them wide. And as we exhale, sending them down towards our belly button in a big circle. Inhale, lift them up. Open to the sides. Exhale, release them down. Do that a few more times. In. And out. Two to go. Last one. Great job. Release your hands right onto your knees. Lengthen through your arms here. And just really feel your weight going towards that back wall. Inhale, look up. Exhale, tuck your chin right into your chest here. Inhale, look up. Exhale, tuck that chin to your chest. Inhale. Exhale. Great job. Inhale, I want you to send your chest forward, bend at your elbows, and look up towards the ceiling. And as we exhale, pull your back towards the wall behind you, lengthen through your arms, turn your tailbone so it's coming up towards the ceiling, and tuck your chin into your chest. Feeling that length through your spine. Inhale, slow and control, roll forward. Send that chest forward, look up. And exhale, take your back towards the wall. Tuck your chin to your chest. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, round. In. And out. Two more. Just waking up our spine, getting it moving. Last one. Great job. Inhale, we're going to bring it forward. This time we're going to go in a circle. So send your body over to the left, lengthening through that right arm. Shift your body towards that back wall. And then we're going to go over towards the right, bending your elbows as needed as you bring it forward. Keep that going. Try and keep your legs on the ground, not really lifting them up. Feeling that movement through your spine all the way down to your hips. And then when you come forward this next time, I want you to reverse directions. And you can really use that breath. And the inhale as you go towards the back. And exhale as you come forward. In. Out. We'll do two more. And last one. And when you come to the center, I want you to just hang out here, folding forward, and just walk your arms out in front. And it's okay if you're not as low as I am. Maybe you're just up here. That's okay. With time, you'll be able to get a little lower. The more you practice, the more your body becomes flexible. And wherever you're at, just tuck your chin into your chest and just really feel this stretch all the way down to your hips. Focus on that breath. Big inhale. Feel the back side of your body lifting this time. Exhale. Let it go. 
Inhale. Exhale. Two more breaths here. See if you can walk your hands out a little farther. Last breath. In and out. And slowly begin to use your hands to guide yourself all the way back up. Inhale, lift those arms up. And as we exhale, I want you to twist to the right. Catch that left hand onto your right knee and look over your right shoulder. Part your lips just slightly, releasing any tension through your neck, your jaw, your shoulders. And just focus on that breath. Big inhale. And exhale, use your abs, press that air out. One more, in. And out. Inhale, twist to the center, bring those arms up and overhead. And exhale, twist to the opposite side. Look over your left shoulder this time. Part through your lips, release through your jaw. And focus on that breath. Inhale. Exhale. Two more here. And last one. Great job. Inhale, arms up and overhead, twist back to center. And as we exhale, release them down. We're gonna come onto all fours. So bring your knees underneath of your hips, your wrists right underneath of your shoulders. Make sure you spread your fingertips nice and wide. Curl those toes under it, a nice flat back here. Send your gaze just out past your nose. Take a big inhale. Exhale. Inhale, drop your belly, send your hips to the sky, send your gaze forward. Press into your hands, lift away from the floor. And as you exhale, tuck your chin into your chest and begin to pull your spine towards the ceiling. Press into your hands, feel yourself lifting out of your shoulders. And exhale. And inhale, drop that belly, look forward, hips go high. Exhale, round. Inhale, exhale, in, out, two more with your own breath. Great job. I want you to inhale, send that right arm forward, spread those fingertips nice and wide. Find your stability here. You can release the tops of your feet down to the floor if you would like. And with that next breath, I want you to send your left leg out. So right arm forward, left leg back. Really point through your toes, point through your fingers. Now I don't want you to just send it up and dip in that low back. Keep a nice stable spine here. Take a big inhale. And as we exhale, slow and controlled, bring your knee and your elbow together right in the center as you arch through your spine. Inhale, lengthen, slow and controlled. Again, no dipping in that low back. Lengthen through, try to get your arm and leg parallel to the floor. And exhale, go ahead and connect into that center. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, connect. In. Out. One more. In. Out. Great. Plant that knee. Plant that palm. We're going to go on the opposite side. So inhale. Bring that left arm forward this time. Spread those fingertips nice and wide. Give them a little wiggle. And then send your right leg back. Point those toes. Really lengthen here. Find your balance. Take a big inhale. And exhale. Slow and controlled. Connect. Round through your spine. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, connect. In. And out. Two more. Last one. Great job. Plant that knee, plant that hand down. Open your knees as wide as your mat. Bring your big toes in to touch. We're gonna bring that right hand underneath of your nose. And as you inhale, glide that left arm across your body. Open it up to the sky here. Take a big breath in and out. 
play around with where you'd like your head, maybe you want to look up, out, down. Find what feels comfortable for you here. To rotate that top thumb towards the wall behind you and make sure you're really tucking that tailbone under. Inhale. Exhale. Really feel that breath into the left rib cage here. Feel it press away. In. Out. Always bring those abs in to engage as you press that air out. One more time. Big breath. In. And exhale. Release that hand down. Plant it under your nose. Inhale, open that right arm all the way up. Big stretch. Tuck that tailbone, rotate that thumb. Focus on your breath. Feel the right rib cage this time lifting. Inhale. Exhale. Feel yourself press into the tops of your feet. Inhale. Exhale. Play around with where you'd like to have your head. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here, in. And as we exhale, bring that hand down. Send your hips to your heels. Walk your hands out in front of you. And slow and controlled, you're gonna release your forehead all the way down to the mat. Coming into our child's pose. Close your eyes. And just let your head get heavy here. Inhaling in through the nose, big breath. And exhale, let it go through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale. One more, just like that. In. And out. Great job. Just let that breath come in and out through the nose here. Close your eyes if you haven't already. And bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of one thing that you're grateful for from today. Inhale, find your flow all the way up to our tabletop position, all fours. Go ahead and curl those toes under. Take a big inhale. And on your exhale, send your hips all the way up to the sky. It's okay if you have a bend in your knees. Your legs feel a little tight. Try to lift your hips a little higher. Turn your biceps towards the wall in front of you and feel yourself pressing into that index finger and thumb pad here. Inhale. And exhale. Try to release your heels a little closer to the ground. Inhale. And as we exhale, really bend those knees. Look forward. Step or walk all the way up to the front of your mat. And we'll release our upper body over our lower body. Get a nice thick bend here in your legs. Releasing through that low back. And then tuck your chin right into your chest. Allow yourself to feel that lengthening through the ne neck all the way down to your tailbone. And just focus on that breath for a moment. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Glide your hands all the way up to your thighs here. Straighten through your legs. Straighten through that upper body. Send your gaze out just past your nose. Inhale. And as we exhale, we're going to forward fold. Release our upper body over our lower body again. Inhale, lengthen. Glide yourself all the way up. And exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Into our halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale. We're going to bend our knees and we're going to draw a big circle with our arms as we stand all the way up. Bring those arms up and overhead. Give yourself a slight back bend here. And then exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. 
want you to plant those palms onto the floor, angling your fingers slightly towards that outside edge, not dramatically, just slightly. And then we're going to step one foot back and then the other. Shift yourself into a plank, making sure your wrists are directly under your shoulders here. You can always drop down and take a modified if you need it. Take a big inhale. Exhale. Feel yourself contracting your abs here. Engage that core. Find your stability. Rotate your inner thighs towards the ceiling. Press away from the floor here. Inhale. Exhale. Begin to feel that shake. It's okay. We're going to stay here for two more breaths. In. Out. One more. In. And on an exhale, keep your elbows at your side and slowly lower all the way down. Release your belly to the floor, uncurl your toes, and inhale, press into your hands and just lift your head, chin, and chest away from the floor into a baby cobra. Really feel your shoulders pulling away from your ears, moving up towards your hips here. And exhale, release your forehead down. Inhale, really pressing your hands, lengthen through your arms, lift that entire upper body away from the floor into our up dog. <coughs> Engage your glutes, keep that low back engaged here. Feel your shoulder blades looping up, back and down, keeping them again far away from your ears. And as we exhale, send your hips to your heels. You can keep your heels, your knees in close. You can open them wide to take that child's pose. And then go ahead and release yourself all the way down to the floor. Close your eyes. Arms can be extended out in front. And just focus on that breath. Inhaling in. And out. In. And out. One more, in, and out, and just let it come to a nice normal rhythm here. Bring a smile onto your lips, and I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today. <clears throat> Find your flow all the way up your tabletop position. Curl those toes under. Take a big breath in. And on an exhale, send your hips all the way up. See if you can lengthen through your legs a little bit more this time. Hips go high. Biceps towards that front wall. You feel yourself really pressing into your index finger knuckles. Focus on that breath. Big inhale. And exhale. Inhale, bend those knees, look forward. Step or walk all the way up to the front. Forward fold. <clears throat> Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle all the way up. Slip back then at the top. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle, all the way up. And this time, exhale, bring your palms together down to your heart and send your hips towards the back, coming into this slightly squatting position, aka chair pose. And extend your arms out in front of you. Make sure your chest stays lifted, your hips go low. Inhale, exhale. Feel your knees pulling in towards one another. Big breath in. And on an exhale, forward fold, send your hips high. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. 
Inhale, big circle all the way up. Exhale, chair. Holding it here. Focus on your breath. Feel your knees coming in towards one another and that chest lifting. Inhale. Exhale. In. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Go ahead and plant your palms down and step just that right leg back, keeping that knee lifted. Inhale, bend through that front leg so you have this 90 degree bend. Front knee is directly in line with that front ankle. Inhale, lift through that chest. Exhale, release that back knee down. Inhale, sweep your arms all the way up. Exhale, pull your elbows down towards the floor. Get a slight back bend here. Inhale, lengthen, arms come up. Exhale, pull them back and down. Inhale, exhale. In, out. Keep that movement going with your arms. Feeling that front knee pulling in towards the center line. Not letting it fall out towards the edge of your mat. Inhale, exhale, really try to feel resistance as you pull your elbows down. Inhale, lift them. Exhale, send them back, hold it there. Really open up your chest here. Really feel your chest lifting, look up. And as we exhale, plant those palms down, send your hips towards your heel, and just feel this lengthening through that left leg. Tuck your chin right into your chest. Inhale, roll through that front foot. Lift your back knee away from the floor. Step your back foot up to meet your left. And then forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Go ahead and plant those palms. Step one foot back and then the other. And let's move through our vinyasa, coming into our plank. Exhale, slowly lower. Inhale, lifting it all the way up into up dog. Exhale, send it back, child's pose. You're more than welcome to take a downward facing dog if you would like as well. Wherever you land, close your eyes. Take a big inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And one more breath here, in. And out. And with that next inhale, find your flow all the way up to downward facing dog. Inhaling in and out. One more breath here, in, out. Bend your knees, look forward, step or walk all the way up to the front of your mat, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, bend those knees, big circles. You come all the way up. Exhale, sink it back into chair. Holding it there for two breaths. In, out. One more, in. And with that exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle, all the way up. Exhale, sink it back, chair. Lift through that chest, sink your hips low. Inhale, exhale. One more, in, exhale, forward fold. Bend those knees, plant those palms. This time we're gonna step that left foot back. Keep that back knee lifted, inhale. Send your chest forward, look up. Exhale, release that back leg down. Inhale, sweep those arms up and overhead. Exhale, draw those elbows down, open up through that chest. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, lower. Inhale, you can sweep your body forward this time. Exhale, pull it back. Inhale. Exhale. Three more. Really feel that front foot grounding into your mat, keeping your balance. One more. Holding it there. Three. Two, one, great. Plant those hands, 
Send your hips to your heels. Feel that lengthening through your front leg and tuck your chin right into your chest. Take a breather in, out. Inhale, roll through that front foot. Lift your back knee away from the ground. Step it up, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant those palms. Step one foot back and then the other and move through your vinyasa. And send it back into child's pose. This time, I encourage you to keep your knees into the center so you can open up through your low back here. Fix your clothes beforehand. You know how that works. <laughs> And then when you're ready, slow and control, release that forehead all the way down. And if your knees are into the center, you can take your hands all the way back by your heels, flip your palms open to the sky. If your knees are open wide, you can just bring your hands right under your shoulders. Close your eyes and just focus on that breath. Big inhale. And exhale. <clears throat> bring a smile onto your lips and I want you to think of a third thing that you're grateful for from today that next inhale, glide your hands up underneath of your shoulders and just press yourself away from the floor. Now's a good time to take and get a drink if you need it. It's close by. And then just let your hips rest in your heels. Sit up nice and tall. You can have your hands on your thighs or at the sides. Loop the shoulders back and down your spine and glide your chin towards the back wall. You can use your right hand and just press it back in space. So you're really aligning your ear over your shoulder. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, sweep your arms all the way up. Exhale, release them down. Inhale. Exhale, release your arms behind your back. Just interlace your fingers here. You can keep your hands kind of wide or try to get your palms together. And with that next inhale, press your chest to the sky, loop your shoulders down your back, and draw your knuckles towards the floor. Focus on that breath. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. In. And with that exhale, slow and controlled release. We're going to send our body weight forward, curl our toes under, and then walk your hands back. Bringing your hips onto your heels again. If this is too much pressure in the bottom of your feet, lift up and away until it's comfortable. So just feel a slight stretch in the bottoms of your feet. Again, sit up nice and tall. Chin goes to the wall behind you. Hands can be on your lap or at your side. And just focus on that breath in, out. Inhale. Exhale. One more, in. And as we exhale, this time send your body weight forward. Legs can go to one side or the other. And release your bottom all the way down to the floor. Extend those legs out in front of you. Sit up nice and tall. Bring your hands at your hips. Plant it onto your mat. Curl those toes in towards your face and feel them rotating in towards one another. Sit up nice and tall, in. Out. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. 
Sweep those arms up. Exhale, fold over your legs, catching wherever you can. Maybe it's your shins, maybe it's your ankles. Maybe in time you'll be able to grab the bottoms of your feet. Feel your body straightening here, bending right from the hips. And exhale, just tuck your chin into your chest. Focusing on that breath. Inhale. And your exhale, feel yourself bending a little more at the hips. Your body shifting forward, not bending from the middle of your spine. Inhale, glide yourself all the way back up. And exhale, release your hands to the mat. Shift your hips forward, plant those heels, extend those arms out in front of you. Inhale. And as we exhale, we're going to slow and control. Release ourselves all the way down to the mat. Extend those arms overhead. Bend your legs. Get a big stretch here. And as you exhale, pull your knees into your chest. Catch them with your hands. Give them a little tug. Inhaling in. And out. Holding them here in the center. Just taking a moment in, out. We're gonna rotate through our ankles, first one way, and the other. Really getting out all those snap, crackles, and pops, huh? <clears throat> I know mine are. And then hold it still, one more breath in. And on an exhale, release one leg all the way down, and then the other. Let your feet fall open as wide as your mat. Your hands fall down to the floor, palms open to the sky. Get yourself comfortable as we move into our final pose, Savasana. Sometimes the hardest pose because this is our time to lay here, to be still, to be present, which just means notice. Notice all the things around you, the scents, the smells, the emotions, the energy. Notice when we're present. And we just simply focus on that breath. Take a big inhale. And exhale. Inhale, biggest breath you've taken all day. In. And exhale, press it out twice as long. Catch your breath naturally. In. And out. And just let it come to a normal rhythm as we move into our savasana. that next inhale, go ahead and wiggle your toes, your fingers, bow your eyelashes, open and close, and then roll onto your side facing me. Use your arm as a pillow, and we'll take a breath here. Inhale, exhale, inhale, press yourself away from the floor, pull it up into a comfortable cross-legged position. Sitting up nice and tall, hands in your lap, eyes closed. Take a big breath in. Out. Bring your palms together up to your forehead. Inhale. Exhale. Be kind in your thoughts. Bring your hands down to your lips. Inhale. 
Exhale. Be kind in your words. Bring your hands down to your heart. In. Out. Be kind in your actions. Take one more big inhale. And as you exhale, bow forward. Namaste. Thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. I hope you feel so much better. I know I do. I needed that session so, so much. So I'm happy that I can give this practice to you and help myself at the same time. I do miss you guys. I hope that we can be back in the gym in the very near future. Because, um, you know, it's been since March. So <laughs> stay happy, stay healthy, stay hydrated because it has been hot. You guys know it has. So with that, have a fantastic day. I'll see you guys later. Bye.